Okay, now I'm going to review Angel by L.A. Weatherly, and I'll read what it says on the back. It says, Willow knows she's different from other girls, and not just because she loves tinkering around with cars. Willow has a gift. She can look into people's futures, know their dreams, their hopes, and their regrets just by touching them. She has no idea where she gets this power from, but Alex does. Gorgeous, mysterious Alex knows Willow's secret and is on a mission to stop her. The dark forces within Willow make her dangerous and irresistible. In spite of himself, Alex finds he is falling in love with his sworn enemy. Um, I loved this book. Um, it's currently my favourite. Um, has been since I read it a um, few, few weeks, months ago now. Quite, quite some time. Um, but since I only just really started doing reviews, I obviously hadn't reviewed it. So, yes, I just adored this book. From the moment I started reading it, I couldn't put it down. It just hooked me from the start. I loved that it um, showed um, Willow's and Alex's um, perspective, so you knew what was going on. And I liked that it wasn't... Um, they weren't in love straight away, they argued, they they acknowledged that each other um, was attractive and that they um, liked them, but um, not in that way, and it sort of grew, which I really did like. Um, I liked both characters a lot, um, the plot was, was great, that um, angels aren't um, good, they're sent from, they've been coming in from this portal to um, to our world to feed off of our auras and leave us in awe of them when in fact they're um, destroying us really and Alex is part of a small group that uh, that know and are trying to rid them and he's sent to destroy um, Willow but she's different she's half angel half human and that's an anomaly that hasn't happened before so he's not sure where he stands and he ends up protecting her from these angels that want her dead because they sense she's a threat to them so their love um, starts from there but it's forbidden because um, well he his family's basically been torn apart by these angels and he feels he shouldn't be feeling anything for Willow apart from hatred but he actually falls in love with her and protects her and um, she feels the same way she um, loves Alex back in the end um, and I know that this is part of a trilogy. Um, I it's quite far, uh, quite hard to find um, standalone books anymore. They all seem to be part of trilogies or series. But um, I do want to read more of Willow and Alex. And I know the second one is Angel Fire, but I'm not sure when it's out because um, Waterstone um, still says June, whereas Amazon says. Um, October I think so I'm not sure when it's out but I know for sure that I will be getting it and reading it as soon as it's out because um, it was just so good and I know the blurb for the second one which also sounds good uh, yes I found that um, LA Weatherly's writing of it was superb it was paced extremely well it was just it was amazing that it wasn't minimal on detail but it was exactly what was needed there wasn't too much there wasn't too little um and it just flowed over the page really well it, it didn't feel like you were reading um 507 pages it, they just went by ridiculously quickly and i recommended this to um my friend who shares the same taste in books as i do and she agreed once she started reading it she couldn't put it down she read it in a day like i did um just it was great it was it's like i said it's my favorite book at the moment um has been for some time and i can't see it being taken off that um yet uh, unless the second one is even more amazing than the first one um but yes she she agreed with me that it was just so fast you could read it and it was amazing and the plot was sound I, d I didn't find anything that I really didn't like about it at all I just and, and normally there will be something that I will um, pick out that I don't like but no this book was for me amazing from start to finish and I nothing to fault it for I just loved it and 
um, yes, it's just, I will recommend this to anybody who likes young adult um, romance genre because it's um, completely original with the um, angels are evil when sucking our aura thing and the forbidden romance between Willow and Alex is greatly developed, the characters are great. Um, yes, and I, I um, liked both characters. They weren't just good to read, I liked them. Um, I just, I wouldn't say they related to them because I can't say that I can relate to a half angel um, girl who likes um, to fix cars, but I'd like to believe that I, I liked her character. I thought she, was, she wasn't um, someone that I didn't like to read. I found like when she was speaking, she didn't irritate me. She um, was a good character, and how she feels for Alex and how she expresses that is just great. And vice versa for Alex, um, overcoming his hatred of what he thinks she is, because he does realise that she's different and she's not evil. And there's a touching scene when he does realise that. So, yes, um, definite read for anyone. Um, and if you do read it, please let me know what you think of it, if you loved it as much as I do. And happy reading!